Hi, it's Steve Sandner here. I'm at Song of the Morning Ranch Yoga Retreat. And this is a harmonium, and it is typically used in Indian music. It was actually invented in Germany, but it has been used for many years, I believe hundreds of years, for Indian classical music and also for Indian chanting, kirtan, sankirtan. And the Indian scale has the same basis of a diatonic scale as the Western scale, although they do tend to like to use the sharp fourth in their scale. So whereas the Western scale goes do, re, mi, fa, so, la, ti, do, the uh, Indian scale uh, as sa, re, ga, ma, pa, da, ni, sa, sa, ni, da, pa, ma, ga, re, sa, sa, re, ga, ma, pa, and they have those little inflections which are sometimes called semitones and they have actually scientifically divided their scale up into 22 different notes and it's not accurate to say they're quarter tones, but they are in between notes in, in the cracks. They still base their tuning system on the Pythagorean tuning system, but they have many other shades of notes in between. Um, here at um, Song of the Morning, we play some of the uh, songs that are based on the traditional chants of the Indian ragas, the, ch the chantings comes from the Indian ragas, and Indian classical music comes from the ragas, which is um, loosely defined as a scale, although it's a scale, uh, it is a template of a, a, a piece with, that the Indian musicians uh, use a lot of improvisation in their performance. But I'm going to do, I'm going to perform one song now that's a popular song from the early 50s that was made popular by Nat King Cole. It was written by Eden Abhez in the late 40s, I believe, and I think Nat King Cole made it popular somewhere after that time. I believe it was in the early 50s. And it was Nat King Cole's first number one hit, and it's called Nature Boy. was a boy a very strange enchanted boy they say he wandered very far very far over land and sea a little shy and sad am I but very wise was he and then one day magic day he passed my way, and as he spoke of many things, fools and kings, this he said to me, the greatest thing you'll ever learn is just to Then one day, one magic day, he passed my way, and as we spoke of many things, fools and kings, this he said to me, the greatest thing you'll ever learn is just to
Thank you.